Hey guys, Brett here, and yesterday it was sunny and warm, but today Mother Nature decided to show us that she's still boss. So I'm going to go ahead and spend the morning shoveling and plowing, but when I'm done, I'm going to head inside, go down to my desk, and show you a new software that originally I was super excited about. But unfortunately, I realized it wasn't quite as awesome as I thought it was. It didn't quite have the features that I thought it did when I first started looking at it. Of course, I realized that this is an opportunity, an opportunity for me to make it even better for my followers and my subscribers. <laughs> Now, while you're waiting for me to go ahead and clean up this mess, I will ask you for one really quick favor. Go ahead and click that like button and let YouTube know that you actually like my videos. This helps more people see my videos and means I can reach more people and help more people. Alrighty guys, so I'm finally back inside, I'm warmed up, and I'm ready to start showing you this new software. I'm going to tell you what I like about it, what I think is really cool, and the one thing that kind of disappointed me when I checked it out. So right now I'm on the JV page for a software called Course Reel. And the JV page is a page that's designed to attract affiliates to promote that product. So it tells about the product and tries to incentivize the affiliates to promote that product. Now, when I read the title on the JV page, it says create and sell online courses without recording videos, writing content or complex editing. Now, online courses is a huge business. People pay a ton of money for them. It is a multi-billion dollar uh, industry. And because of that, I became interested in this. But I want you to really pay attention to this text right here where it says create and sell online courses. You see, given the fact that it says create and sell online courses, I thought that this was going to build some kind of membership area, some kind of site where I can create a course, get people to sign up inside of the, the site, and then join that site in order to access that course. So I thought it was gonna be a complete solution, a solution that allows me to not only create the course, but also to have a site where I can sell that course, collect payments and get people into a member's area, you know, an all-in-one solution. Unfortunately, when I started testing this software, I was very disappointed. So here I am, I'm now logged into the review access account for Course Reel that I got from the product vendor. And you can see I did indeed create my first course. I'm gonna go ahead real quick and create a new course just so you can see how it's done. And then I'll explain the thing that I didn't like about it. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna click on create new course. It's gonna ask me for my course name. I'm gonna call this a second test because I'm not very creative. So I'll type in second test. I want the country to be United States. I don't know why the country really matters, but I want the language to be English. That's fine. I'll go ahead and click on next. It's going to ask me for a keyword for my course. So I'm going to call this internet marketing. I'll just type that in because that's what I'm interested in. I'll click on search topics. And the AI is then going to create a number of topics that I can select from in order to uh, create my course on. Now, I will be honest, this particular part I find a little bit uh, tedious and a little bit unnecessary. I should just be able to type in the topic of my course. I mean, why do I have to type in a keyword and then search the topics? For example, right now I want to create a course on a beginner's guide to internet marketing. But I can't because there is none that was that picked here. Um, you know, you cannot specify the exact topic that you want, you have to go by one of the AI recommendations. And I understand that the product vendor did this to make things more easy for people, to help people get ideas, but there should be an option. There should be an option to either specifically type in, I want to create a course on this very specific topic, or I want you to make suggestions. Uh, from what I can see, there is uh, only the option to have a uh, keyword entered and then pick a suggestion. Okay, so I'm gonna pick uh, affiliate marketing, a step-by-step -step guide. I'll click on use this. It's then gonna create a number of recommended chapters for my course. Now it's important to keep in mind that a chapter is basically just a video. So it's gonna create a number of recommended videos for my course. I can go ahead and add the ones that I want. And I can move these around and reorganize them if I like to, which again is something that makes absolutely no sense. And you'll understand why it makes absolutely no sense to even be able to do this in a second because there's really no point in it. <laughs> I'll, go ahead, I'll show you why in a second. So I'm going to go ahead and click on next here and we'll go ahead and continue. Okay. So now here is all the, the chapters that I've selected. And what AI is going to do is then going to write text for each chapter. And it's going to change that text into a video for me. 
out. In order to do that, I go ahead and click on this and I select the one that I want. I'll start with the very first one. This is the very first one. I'm going to create write update. I'm going to have it generate text for me. And then I'm going to go ahead and just use this text right here. In order to do that, I'll have to take it from here and put it over there. So I'll go ahead and click on copy all. I'll paste it inside of here. And then I can go ahead and click on next. Now I can change that script if I want to. I really don't have any interest in doing that. I just want AI to do all the work for me. So it's going to then ask me the format that I want. If I want to use AI images or stock images, the video dimensions that I want, if I want to have the talking head, or if I want to clone my own voice. I don't want to do any of that. So I'm just going to go ahead and click on generate video. And it's going to go ahead and generate my video. Now I have to wait a few minutes for my video to be generated. Okay, so now that my video is generated, you can see right here it says awaiting customization. I go ahead and click on edit. I can go ahead and customize this however I want. I can change this text, move it around, I can change the slides, the voiceover, add new media, change the background. It's fully customizable at this point. Once I have it set up the way I want, I can go ahead and click on the render button. Now, I don't want to change things, so I'm just going to go ahead and click on that render button and render my video. Now, while this is rendering, I can go ahead and I can start generating scripts and continuing to all of these other videos inside of my course. I don't have to wait. I can just keep moving ahead and get them all done and get them all rendering. I'm not going to do that, though, because I really just want to show how this works. What I really want to focus on in this video is the thing about this that let me down and how I solved that problem, how I made it a much more complete and much more useful system. And the thing that let me down was when I got to this page. After my course was completely created, I went here and I saw that I had a couple of options. I can edit or I can delete it. But I started thinking, I was like, where's my site? How do I access my course? How do I create the sales page for my course? How do I sell the course? Like, where is all this, the, where is the course? Like, I mean, I can go ahead here and I can click edit and I can download all the videos for my course, but where, how, how is my course gonna get to the customer? So I messaged Abi Davidi, the vendor of this product, and I asked him, you know, like, wh where's everything else? He's like, no, it, it doesn't do that. It doesn't create a site for you. It's just a video creator. So it, you can create a, a video course, but it's it just, you get the videos. You can download the videos to your computer, and then you have to do something with them. He actually suggested people could put them on Udemy, uh, but honestly, I don't think something like this would do well on Udemy. I think it would do much better on a, as a standalone site with a members area. And I thought that this system provided all that stuff, but it doesn't. It just creates the videos. This is why back in uh, the first step where it, it asks you to order your videos makes absolutely no sense. I thought I was ordering them in the way they're going to be presented to the customer once they access the members area. But it makes absolutely no sense because there is no members area. It doesn't create a members area for you. It doesn't give you a way to sell the site, you know, to sell the course. It just generates the videos, then you have to download them to your computer and upload them somewhere else. And because of that, I realized that Course Reel is not really a complete solution. It, it's a video creator, but it doesn't create video courses. It doesn't do the thing that it says on the JV page. Again, remember, this is the JV page. And on it, the very first words are create and sell online courses. That's even highlighted in a different color. Uh, so it made me think that this solution allows you to create and sell online courses. It really does. It allows you to create videos. Uh, you can't sell online courses. It doesn't create an online course. It doesn't put your course online for you. Uh, so it's really only half of a solution. What people really need is a way to create a members area, a way to create a sales page, a way to collect a payment, so that way they can sell that online uh, course. And for a second there, I was honestly thinking to myself, I'm not going to really even endorse this product just because I felt like it was only half a solution. And then I realized something, something pretty darn important. I have this site. This system is called ULEARN, and ULEARN is a system that I created that allows people to create online courses that they can sell. ULEARN is a complete solution. It allows people to not only create a course using AI that generates the entire course for them from start to beginning, you really just tell it what you want the course to be about, but it also creates a sales page, has a members area, and allows you to collect payments via Stripe. ULEARN is a 100% complete online solution for creating and selling online courses. 
However, there is one thing about it. The courses that you create are 100% text. It allows you to create text courses. So each section in the course is text that's generated by the AI. It doesn't create videos. However, there is a section to add videos inside of each of the courses. Well, if you combine this with Course Reel, now you can create your course and the videos in Course Reel and put them inside of your members area with ULEARN. You can sell your course, you can collect payments, you can have an auto-generated sales page via AI, you can have everything you need as a complete solution by combining these two things. And because of that, I realized that Course Reel is a perfect add-on to the ULEARN system. Or I could say that ULEARN is the perfect add-on to Course Reel. They work perfectly together to create a complete solution for anybody that wants to use AI to sell online courses. And because of that, I decided to give away ULEARN completely free to anybody who picks up Course Reel AI through me. Look in the description to click find the link to check out my bonus page. Just keep in mind that on my bonus page, there is gonna be a timer. And when that timer expires, I will not be giving away the ULEARN bonus anymore. So if you're gonna pick up Course Reel through me, make sure you claim that bonus right away. Thank you and enjoy.